Hey guys, I have the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus for the month of December for you guys. I do get sent this in PR, so this is the PR one, but I will have the not PR one, which is the one that I'm subscribed to later on in the month if you are interested. So definitely check around, or stick around <laughs> my channel by subscribing and hitting that little red button. And you can also follow me on my social media down below on my Instagram. So we're gonna go ahead and jump into the box. I do have a uh, timestamp down below because I will have a little bit of a try on. There was only one product in here to try on, which was a palette. And then the rest of the stuff, I just um, am either gonna put in giveaways or, you know, it's skincare and things like that. So because this is a PR box, they did send me this cute little happy holiday um, Ipsy Open Studio 200 piece puzzle. I'm going to definitely let my husband do this because he loves puzzles. So I thought that that was super cute. And then they also, sent a little deck of cards for like Christmas time. So I thought those were cute little details and I've seen that they do like little extras in their PR boxes. So I think that that's super sweet to do for their influencers. So let's go ahead and jump into the uh, box itself. And the first thing in here is the QMS Ace Vitamin Day and Night Cream. QMS is a very, very pricey brand. All of their stuff is like over $100. Uh, so this would not surprise me if it is. That's the only thing I wish we had little cards with the um, price points. I really, really enjoy having price points just to be able to kind of you know, calculate how much it is and know how much each product is. But uh, I do know for a fact that QMS is super expensive. And this says that it uh, has vitamins, botanical marine complex, and it moisturizes and protects and you can use it day or night. And QMS has this really cute blue packaging. You guys are gonna have to excuse me because my wrist has been killing me and um, you know, I have a appointment with a specialist, so that is important. So here is what it looks like. Their packaging is very cute and high-end looking, so really nice on your, um, you know, where you do your creams, whether it be on your bathroom and things like that. I know some people are iffy about packaging. <laughs> the next product in here is the Verifee 2020 Phytoclin Peptides Eye Cream. This thing is ginormous and has 0.5 fluid ounces and is a pump like this. Um, I will be putting this probably in a giveaway on my Instagram if you guys wanna follow me down below uh, because I am currently using probably like four eye creams <laughs> and I only have one set of pair of eyes. So I will probably give this to a family member or I do a giveaway for you guys. Next thing in here is the Wander Beauty Sky liner in black. I also own probably like five black liners. And so I love Wander Beauty, but I am going to put this uh, as well in a giveaway reason that I did not try it on. Then the next thing in here is the Tula Skincare um, Exfoliating Sugar Scrub. This is a sugar scrub. I don't know if this is for your face. Yes, this is for your face. So I will be trying this out because right now my scrub for my face is running low. So I'm gonna go ahead and try this out and see if I like it. I have heard very good things about Tula Skincare. And then the last thing is actually what's in the try-on portion, which is this bad boy right here. This is the Nomad times Toscana palette and that is what it looks like. It has a cute little mirror. I wish it was a little bit smaller for a nine pan, but the shades are absolutely gorgeous. I really enjoy their formulation and I used probably close to like almost all the shades. I used one, two, three, four, five, six out of the nine shades. And I will do more looks for you on Instagram. I do a lot of wearable looks over there if you're interested in that. I do a lot of little videos over there. so. Definitely stick around for the try on um, if you guys want to see that. And then the bag itself is here on the bottom and I'll go ahead and show you what it looks like. And it is so fluffy and cute and red. I absolutely love this like wool like um, material. It kind of has, oh, it kind of has like a permeable um, thing on the inside. So it's not like, um, you know, so if it was to get dirty on the inside, it would be easy to clean. So that is the little bag and we will jump into the try on portion so you guys can see me do this eye look and then give you my final thoughts. So for the try on portion, we are going to use this Nomad Toscana palette. It is beautiful little nine pan 
tan neutral palette. It looks really, really cute. I wish it wasn't as thick and big just because most nine pans nowadays are so tiny. I'm gonna take out my little, you know, my little color pop one so you guys can see the difference, you know? Um, I really enjoy palettes that are smaller, more, you know, more tiny, tiny. So yeah, so this, this I wish was a little bit tinier. It is beautiful packaging, it's cute, but I wish it was, you know, shrink it down a little bit. Anyways, but that's just personal preference. So we're gonna go ahead and get started and, hmm. And then I'm gonna start with these two shades right here and put them towards, I think I'm gonna do, yeah, a very, very, very warm look. And I'm gonna take out Miss Piggy right here. And I'm gonna start with Cantucci, which is the, the shade, the first shade that I went in. And it's just a gorgeous matte shade. I think I'm gonna just do one eye on camera and then do the other one off of camera for you guys. It's easier for me to record that way than going back and forth. So just wind wiper, wind wiper? <laughs> what are those called on the cars? Oh God, I sound dumb. My husband's probably gonna be embarrassed when he sees this, but what else? Okay. Windshield wiper, that's what it's called. Weeple, weeple. And then I'm gonna go in with a smaller little brush and go into Vinoble, which is the right hand top shade right here. I think I'm gonna put this on the lid and make it just like a very warm look. So it goes with my lipstick. So just put that on the outer V. So just a tad bit, just a, just a little bit, just. Just like a little kiss on the outside there. Oh yes. And then next I'm gonna go in with that Vin Santo that I showed you guys. It's a gorgeous shade. And just apply that to the outer lid. And then let's see what else we can play around with in here. Hmm. Oh, I like this one. Let's play with this one, this Renacimiento. Wow, these names is fancy. This one is a matte one. Oh, that's a little chalky. A little chalky, but very pigmented. Not mad at it. And then I'll blend these out all together. Sometimes I just take a fluffy brush and it, if it doesn't have anything and then just, you know, go in and mix them together. And then that really, really the lightest shade in the palette, I'm going to use that as my little inner corner. Whoa, ho, ho, that is pigmented. Whoa, Nelly. Okay, so I'm going to blend those together. And for the under eye, hmm, what else can I play with in here? I think for the under eye, I'm gonna go in with this La Bivella and then this one on the outer edge. I'm just, I'm just playing around with a lot of color. Making it a very warm, colorful look. Yes, so I'm gonna go ahead and just, like I said, I just take a brush like this with nothing on it and basically do this blend 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 and just blend those little edges together and you can see it just coming together and if i have to add a little bit of color i do so i'm going to finish the other eye and then come with my final thoughts okay before i jump into the final thoughts i wanted to share with you guys some other stuff that they sent me and this is called refreshments and i think it's a line that ipsy is either making for themselves but i thought it was super sweet it says why settle for basics when you can have refreshments look at how cute this little bag is and um inside here they have three different things that they sent me they have these wipes that are um, cleansing facial wipes. It's a 30 count. These are so cute. I love the packaging on these. So it says, take it all off. You've never looked better. It's sparkling clean. It's vegan. It 
it seems to have some kind of fruit kind of scent to it so i will definitely let me see let me see how it smells okay it has a clean set smell it doesn't like smell too strong or anything like that so i will definitely be trying these out and let you guys know they also put like these cute little um stickers in here and then there is a body cream which has like a citrus smell and then a hand cream as well that has a like citrus so i'm not sure if this is a new brand that they're promoting if i have any extra in information for you guys i will leave it down below but i did want it to share with you guys just so you knew that this brand is available and it's probably available on ipsy to buy as well for my final thoughts i have to say i absolutely love the palette really enjoy a lot of the skincare i'm excited to try this um, scrub the uh, face cream i'm trying to debate if i'm going to keep it or not just because i have so many and it is so hard to use so much stuff also the eye cream and the um you know the eyeliner i feel like the the bag was a good bag in general i really enjoy the mix of skincare with makeup let me know what your choice for this month was i will have like i said my not pr bag coming sometime in about a week or so it usually comes so you guys can see that video as well let me know what you are looking forward to i'd love to hear from you down below if you're not subscribed hit that little red button subscribe to my channel you can follow me on my social media down below and i'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.